Yesterday, we had some interesting movements in our beloved team's practice. Bobby McMahon and Max Domi were absent from the training, keeping everyone on the lookout for updates. According to sports news guru Mark Masters from TSN, Sheldon Keefe confirmed that McMahon won't hit the field in the last two games of this season. As for Domi, who got injured in the match against the New Jersey Devils, he's a question mark for Tuesday's game and listed as doubtful for Wednesday. So, will Domi recover in time? Furthermore, there were some changes in the training lines. Bertuzzi, Matthews, and Marner showcased their skills training together on the first line, while Jake McCabe tried out on the second defensive line after a scare with a puck on Saturday. Ah, we can't forget about our top scorer Matthews. With 69 goals this season and an incredible streak of eight consecutive game scoring, he's getting closer to surpassing the 70-goal mark in a season. A milestone not seen since 1992-93. How about betting that he'll achieve it? To top it off, the Leafs are wrapping up the season facing tough opponents, the Florida Panthers and the Tampa Bay Lightning. It's going to be thrilling, right? And to conclude, the training surprise was Kaye Jarncroc returning from a hand injury. Keith mentioned that he's not fully ready to play yet, and his status for the start of the playoffs is uncertain. Will Jarncroc come back strong? As a Leafs fan, these news make me somewhat apprehensive, especially with McMahon's absence and the uncertainty around Domi's condition. It's moments like these that highlight the importance of teamwork and the depth of the roster to overcome challenges. Seeing Matthews so close to reaching the historical milestone of 70 goals in a season is exhilarating and makes us cheer even more for him. His determination and scoring ability are inspiring and showcase the exceptional talent we have in our team. With the playoffs on the horizon, each injury and each player in doubt become even more significant. It's time to support the Leafs unconditionally and believe that, even with obstacles, our grit and will to win will be our greatest strengths. May Jarncroc's return bring more strength to the team, and may we face the challenges with courage and resilience. I'm confident that the Leafs have everything to shine in the playoffs and show the hockey world our spirit and passion for the sport. Let's make history together. So, what do you think of these team movements, folks? Who will be missed in the final games of the season? And what's your prediction for the Leafs' performance in the playoffs? Don't hesitate to comment and share your opinions. Let's cheer together for our Leafs.